Okay, another interesting product update. Uh, it's currently in beta on HubSpot. And yeah, I wanted to walk through it. I was just talking about this with someone the other day about how this was not possible. And so it was just extra funny to me um, that HubSpot decided to release the beta the week after I said it was not possible. Um, okay, cool. So basically what it is, if you're familiar with campaigns before when you're creating a campaign you'd have the option to insert budget spend and budget total um and you'll see here that those those properties didn't go away but when you create the, the record and you can go in as well if you have campaigns that you use in hubspot and then try this for yourself um those went away they used to just be values that you'd have to go in and update manually and didn't provide too much help but now you can actually add line items. So let's say, you know, flyers for campaign, um, you know, purchase, let's see, a thousand flyers for guerrilla marketing. Okay, maybe that's a thousand dollars. And then we can track spend. So if we go here, and we say um, flyers for campaign. Now, what would be cool in HubSpot product team, if you're listening, um, if someone sets a budget for something, did they think of it? No, okay. Then they likely should be able to select that um, for a spend as well. But let's say 500 um, flyers for guerrilla marketing. And um, I guess I did set this as the unit price. That's also kind of an interesting way to refer to price. Um, but let's just go ahead and say 500. Okay, cool. And the cool thing about this is now I can create more. And so let's say maybe there's a table, table for the event, we'll do 100 bucks. And so you can see your total spend so far and any remaining budget that you have on the campaign. So I'm excited. I'm interested to see um, what sort of other reports that this unlocks. If we can move these to uh, any dashboards or anything like that in the future, that, was, that seems cool, uh, seems promising. But um, yeah, if you're using campaigns and you're you're likely tracking your budget spend still in an Excel spreadsheet, um, just because HubSpot's way of budget and spend tracking wasn't super great before um, but this is a lot more actionable in my opinion um, helps you understand you know what specifically you're spending the money on rather than making it a black box uh, where it's just a, a, total, a total budget and a total spend so um, let me know what you think if you're planning on using this um, yeah